Hey, what's up, what's up, mga amigos? Welcome back to my channel. So a few days back, guys, I made a video, a tutorial um, on how to make a video intro in your YouTube channel. So now, guys, um, just stay tuned. I will show you now again on how to convert MKB files to MP4. But before that, guys, if you didn't watch the video yet that I made before, I will put the link down here below. So make sure, guys, watch the video until the end. Okay, guys, come on, let's get it on. Okay, guys, so once you are done um, saving the clip that you made for your intro in your YouTube channel, so the next thing to do is we have to open the files in uh, KindMaster. So let's open it if it's uh, if it's supported in KindMaster, okay? So let's open it. So we have to select here. So let's open the media. So for example, I want to open the files that we saved in the panzoid.com. So let's check it out. Let's open it. So as you can see guys, it's uh, showing this one is unsupported file format. So uh, before we can export this file in a kind master, we have to convert so now this is the one that we save in the pansoid.com this is the the format as you can see here guys when you click this information okay when you click this one it will show this one the mkv so this is the file yeah mkv so once you load this format in uh, kind master it will not be supported so let's check it out so guys before we um, convert the mkv files we have to download first this application so now this is the application, the InShot. So what we're going to do is just open the file from here, from video. Click video, okay, and open uh, this new folder. So from this, just select the files, guys. So once you play the video, so. Just open the file here and click this uh, canvas, I mean the size, it must be 16 by 9. This is for YouTube uh, thumbnails, okay? So once you uh, put the, the file from the MKB, MKB files, just save it. But before you save it, as you can see here, there is a InShot watermark. So. Uh, the first thing we have to do is to remove this and shut watermark so if you didn't remove this one actually when you save the file it will show in your um, in your clip so how to remove this one just just click this X button okay just click this one and it will show this um, ads so if you want to delete permanently just pay 11 dirham if you have extra money but Good news guys, you can remove this one for free. But the thing is, when you click this, when you click this one, free remove, there's an um, advertisement. It's, it's okay. It's, there's uh, like 10 minutes or 15, uh, no, not 15 minutes. There is uh, like 10 to 15 seconds ads. It's fine. Just finish the ads and that's it. So for example, I will click free, uh, remove this free. So once it finished the ads, just click X. So that's it guys. The InShot watermark is gone. So now we have to do is just save the file. Okay, click the save. And click save. And 1080p. This is for the good quality. And this is it. Save. So now guys, let's see uh, the one that we save from uh, from iShot. So how to check the file just click this i button okay just click this one and as you can see here this is now the file is the extension is mp4 now yeah so this one before it's mkv now mp4 so let's play it so now you can you can load this now in a kind master to edit your video now let's play it yeah. <laughs> Smoking on booth in his Maui. 
just open the file in Kinemaster. Let's uh, try it. Just click that and 16 by 9. Now let's uh, load the, the file. Just click media. And this is the one. Just select the file. So, guys, now as you can see, it's already supported. So, now, guys, you can edit now your video. So, you can see, so you can play it now. So, guys, hope you learned some uh, new ideas from my um, small video tutorials. Alright, guys, but please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon for more upcoming videos okay guys thank you so much